On Dustin's outside, Justin Arnold in the number 12 pickup. First time out this year. He's coming out of salt. Sorry. So inside row number two, Mr. Levi Harris in the 42. Out of Conway, Missouri. On his outside, Dylan Bowman, the number 69 machine out of Purdy, Missouri. Starting in the rear. Gonna be James Adams in the level zero. Don't think he was able to make it out. Winnie Coates, unfortunately, they blew up the rear end. Out of Joplin, Missouri. So just gonna be a four car. Isaacs and Arnold on the front row. Looking for that Ozark final restart zone. We're gonna give him the green flag. Here we go. Excellent start for the 714 machine coming on the outside pole. He'll take the lead right off the bat. The 42 machine of Levi Harris up to that second spot. Dylan Bummy will look to the inside of the 12 machine of Justin Arnold. He pulls it and flies off the back side. Got to break out the caution. All right, going to do a double file restart here. Zero laps in the books. Ready to get this thing started here. Dylan Bowman on that front row now. 7.14 gets her started. Rip up and a bang and watch out. Seven one for Dustin Isaacs out front all by his lonesome. Dylan Bowman gets away from that 12 machine. Number 42 of Levi Harris in that second spot. Ron, second lead for your number 714. Leading here after one lap. Levi Harris just one second behind Dylan Bowman in that second, third spot rather. Justin Arnold. Rounding out your field. Pickup runs up a little bit high. Tacks the wall. Everybody, unfortunately, gets a little stretched out here. 714 of Isaacs out front by 1.332. Justin Isaacs, Levi Harris, and Dylan Bowman, all the blue and orange cars ready to get it on. Here we go. Justin Isaacs, another good restart here. Three laps in the books of 12. Bowman narrowing the gap there between second and third. That 69 machine looking to the top side. Really good down the straightaways. Narrows the gap at the end there. The heavy 42 looking to the go to the bottom side. Justin Isaacs out front by 1.848 seconds. Over the 42, Levi Harris, good run for Bowman on the bottom side. He gets one in there. He's at his door. Halfway through. Bowman going to look again to that top side, get a run off the top, shoots her down to the bottom. Another good run. Look at all that speed he's able to carry down the back stretch. Gonna take a look to the top side, and it must be right up there still, because that was a good spin. Keep up the trend, buddy! Yeah! I like what we're doing here. Oh, Thomas Towing, you take the night off. Lights are out. We're single file, ready to get it on. Get up there, Harris, let's go! Green flag. 
going side by side with Harris as they go on the one and two. Bowman on the bottom side, Harris on the top side, Levi Harris falls back to the third spot. Dylan Bowman on the revenge tour here. Point three seven zero seconds the distance between Dylan Bowen and Dustin Isaacs. Problems on the 42 machine. He's gonna take it off the track. And right there were two. Seven fourteen, and Dustin Isaacs out front by almost three seconds. They'll be looking for the white flag this time. By one more time around for the seven fourteen of Dustin Isaacs. Isaacs brings it off a three and four. Running a perfect race, he'll take the win! Dustin Isaacs with the 714, taking the win there. Dylan Bowman coming in second. Pretty entertaining race for just four cars. We can do that here. We have the technology. Start just like his heat race. Watch out the 292 of Garrett Thompson. Oh! Hard hit there. Going to be an original restart here. You're now part of Hearts Power on Midwest Modified A feature. Time to get it on again. Muhlenberg brings him around three and four. Hits the old loud pedal. Here we go. Muhlenberg, another great jump. Thompson brother side by side. We're going to be three wide. We're back off, watch out, that's a slick spot! That top side is dangerous. All right, gonna try it again here. Muehlberg and Bell. Attempt number two. Number three. Number four. Muhlenberg and Bell bring them around three and four. Muhlenberg with a little break check action. Here we go. Muhlenberg all by himself out front. Thompson Brothers again follow trying to get around my Bell machine. Muhlenberg, Thompson, Thompson, Bell. Side. Here we go. Gonna pay for that bottom side, Pete. Thompson looking for the lead here as he comes to three and four. Woo! 
Driver Kyle Thompson is good. Hard, hard hit. Stop. 
We need to get your butt Zombie! Get out of here! Get it! That is a zombie car if I ever seen it. What a hard hit. It just drives it right back out here. Gonna be a green, white, checkered finish due to a time mark. Lights are out. Can we finish two lots? To be determined. Muhlenberg, Garrett Thompson, and well, your top three. Green flag, here we go. Thompson going to take a look to the bottom side. Thompson looking at the white flag. Going up right on Thompson. And that'll end it. Steve Yulenberg, your winner. Ready to get it on, wheel to wheel, door to door. Coming out here, lap number five. How about a 
success so far, ladies and gentlemen. How about it so far, ladies and gentlemen? Kasha coming out here on lap number five, Alco Harrison, number 40 machine. Excellent racing so far here. Five laps in the books. Front that L5 machine, Brian Brown, Derek Brown right behind him. Johnny Coates gonna be on that bottom side, Robbie Brett on his outside. Muskrat and Caleb Brown. Right now, Kyle Davis gaining six spots already. I knew it was gonna be tough for him. He's already up to that ninth spot. Lights are out. Gonna be green flag for the L5 here. Logan Brown, green flag, here we go. We're spinning down the front. We've got a parking lot going into turn number one. Lineup is right, lights are up. Five down, 25 to go. Brown, 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 your top three. Logan Brown brings him out of three and four, hits our line pedal, here we go. Brian Brown getting a little lean on Derek Brown as they come through. A lot of damage on that 64 machine. They're going to look to get off the track here. Hopefully they can get out of time. Logan Brown coming around to lead another lap here. Muscat really loose. Coming off the turn number four must be a problem. Ewing, welcome to the top five. Logan Brown, Derek Brown, Brian Brown, your top three, Johnny Coates and Blaine Ewing. Top side. Oh, he almost had a good run. Watch out. Derek Brown on the bottom. Good run. Trying to break away from the side by side. Bottom up and a banging going on. 22 goes into the wall there. Green flag. Here we go. Logan Brown sends it off into one and two down the back stretch. Brian Brown with another good restart going down the back stretch. Side by side action for that fourth spot. They're going to be between Coates and Ewing. Eight cars remain here as we come to lap number eight. Derek Brown trying to take a look to the inside of Logan Brown. Coates looking at the top side of Brian Brown. Top five right there together. Starting to break away. Great big runs from Brown and Coates. Yeah. 
Rogan round on the L5. Watch out, Derek Brown on the bottom side. Just couldn't put a nose in there. Logan Brown motors up. Top four starting to pull away. Blaine Ewan doing his best to tackle off. Logan Brown looking over real good out front here. Derek Brown, Brian Brown, out front, less than a second. Separates your top three. Coates on that top side, gonna try to get around. Out oh, here, many people running that high side, working for Mr. Johnny Coates there as he takes that first spot away. Derek Brown still trying to get that nose in there. Logan Brown still your leader. Coach just motoring on that top side, boy. Somebody needs to switch something. Johnny Coates, another good run on that top side. That's the only way you're going to get around there, Mr. Derek Brown. Logan Brown's going to be worried about Derek Brown on that bottom side. Coates is going to sneak up there. Brian Brown going to follow Coates on that top side. Logan Brown still out front. Jared Brown on second. Brian Brown looking to find that spot right down there. Trying to get around Johnny Coates. Top four, starting to break away. Here's a good run from Derek Brown. He's on the side of him, this side by side. He's gonna be out the back stretch. Derek Brown. Derek Brown gonna try to slide up. Watch out, Coates is off the top. That's gonna bring out the caution. <laughs> right in the middle of good action right there, Mr. Logan Brown. You did get past. Tough break for the 11 B. After all that work, caution comes out before they cross the line. Greenfield, here we go. Logan Brown, your leader here. 16 laps in the books of 30, 14 left to go. Can Derek Brown make it around him again? Brian Brown looking at the top side. It's going to get interesting here, folks. Look at him poke his nose in there side by side. This could be for the lead as they're going three wide. Brian Brown on the outside. Brian Brown looking for the lead. Coming off of turn number two. Derek Brown trying to take that second spot. They're side by side. Brian Brown, your new leader here. Brian Brown at 69 out front. This time by. Brian Brown, your leader here, 21 laps, and it looks nine to go. The countdown begins. 
He's still got a fight to go with Derek Brown. They are right there. He broke away from Logan Brown. They're up 12. In the back there, Akilah Brown. We're fighting for the lead off the turn number four. This is not over till the fat lady sings. Brian Brown and Derek Brown battered out. Battered out. I can't even get my words out. I hope you guys are getting some awesome shots of these. Brian Brown, advantage on that top side. Seven to go that time by. 69 of Brian Brown on the top side. Derek Brown on the bottom. One J machine. Oh, Brian Brown up in that top side. Is he gonna squeeze him off? No, they'll still race. Brian Brown with the lead here. Derek Brown not going anywhere. Logan Brown falls back. He's three seconds behind this lead pack. I knew once this thing got to go, and it was going to be a good one, didn't you, Tom, though? Brian Brown still your leader out front. Side by side action non-stop. Brian Brown still holding on to that advantage on the top side. Derek Brown on the 11 B on the bottom. He's throwing everything but the kitchen sink at him. This is a good run from the 11 B as they go down the back stretch. He may have them as they go into turn number three. Side by side. Brown still able to continue the lead there. I don't want this to end, but ladies and gentlemen, we're looking at one more time around. Who's gonna take it? Brian Brown assumes the lead pretty fast there. One more time around, they're gonna be side by side. Derek Brown on the bottom. Brian Brown, he also hit that now spot boy because he is sending it, boy. Into three and four. Gonna be looking for that 4,004 to win. Who's gonna take it, ladies and gentlemen? It's gonna be Brian Brown. Ladies and gentlemen, if that's not your favorite race of the year, I don't know what could beat it. Brian Brown taking home the win! Awesome race between Brian Brown and Derek Brown there. Logan Brown coming in that third spot. Lane Ewing in fourth. And the neon icon, Robbie Bratton, taking home your top five. What a good race. Be sure to go back and see that one on Show Me Dirt, because that is going to be a classic for a long time. All right, starting on the pole is going to be Trenton Simon in the 72S. That a chop on his ring on his outside. It's going to be Chance Gilbert in the 801 machine. Inside row number two is going to be Mike Gilbert, number 31 on his outside. Chris Luttrell in the 82L. Inside row number three is going to be Evan Pyle in the 72 on his outside. Last week's winner, Phil Berkey Pyle in the 57 machine. Inside row number four is going to be Peyton Pyle in the 41 on his outside. Tanner Foster in that one. And starting in the rear there is going to be Kenny Foster out of Spokane, Missouri in the 55 and on his outside, Zerny Vets. My goodness, what a good, a good race. I need a cheeseburger and a Budweiser after that one. Lights are out, we're ready to get it on right now. Simon Gilbert on your front row. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get it on! We're bumping a thing at all, ladies and gentlemen. Trent Simon, all by himself out front. Three wide through one and two. The 72 machine of Evan Powell falls back. 
Counter headed back up. He's going to try to get back up into position. Trent Simon is going to be out front by almost a whole second here. You wouldn't believe it, but most of these cars are running the same speed as a B-Mod. Same lap times as most of the B-Mods here. Chance Gilbert in that second spot. First battle for position is going to be for third between the 31 machine and the 82 of Mike Gilbert and Chris Letcher, respectively. Gilbert on the bottom side in the Kellogg's Frosted Flakes looking car. Two of Letro closes that gap pretty quick. 41 of Peyton Powell. Right there in your top five. Top five starting to break away. 57 of Berkey Bow. Just outside the top five. Last week's winner there. Had a heck of a battle with the 11 of Mike Sites. Mike Sites not able to make it here tonight. Four machine, 41 machine rather, Peyton Powell looking at the bottom side. That's going to be a pass for the fourth spot. They're still side by side as they make their way down the front stretch here. Wheel to wheel. Tanner Foster looking to get it around Phil Berkeybaugh. And he'll complete the pass as they go down the back stretch now. Maybe problems on that 55 machine of Kenny Foster. He'll take her to the back. Trent Simon out for a big 2.6 seconds ahead of Chance Gilbert in that 01 machine. Chance another two seconds back to Mike Gilbert. First drop on Lock and Key Caution coming out here on lap number six. Delaware double file restart coming right at you. Lights are out, we're ready to get it on. Trent Simon out front all by his lonesome chance of Mike Gilbert. Row number two, here we go. Chance Gilbert, Trent Simon, excellent restart. Everybody else bunched up for that third spot. Big battle for third as they come through. Finishing lap number seven. Lap oh, number seven, right? Mike Gilbert, your current third place car. Big battle. It's going to be for fourth. Chris Lutcher and Peyton Pyle. Lutcher on the Holding the position now, Powell holding top five. Trent Simon, Chance Gilbert starting to break away again. Just a second between first and second. Starting to make his way up. Want to get that top three there. Kasha coming out one more time for the 85 of his. You know, if you guys would go at consistent speed, that would be a lot easier. Ready to get this thing started. Trip Simon in the 72 has springs him around. It's a lot pedal. Here we go. Much better start for Chance Gilbert that time. He's right there at the back door with Trent and Simon. Mike Gilbert got a whole hornet's nest behind him of some angry bees. It's not a hornet's nest if they're bees, you dumb.
sound a lot of cooler in my head when I said it. Trick Simon out front by three tenths of a second that last time by. Four tenths of a second this time. Over the 0-1, a chance Gilbert. Mike Gilbert. Chris Lutchell still battling for that third spot. A little bump and a bang going on between the run and the 57 of Bucky Ball. Problems on the lead car. He'll take her to the inside. That is very unfortunate. Your new leader, Chance Gilbert, in the 01 machine. them around. Patience is a virtue, am I right, my friend? The white flag coming out for the Owana Chance Gilbert. Gonna be a Gilbert Gilbert one-two finish if things go as planned. Chance Gilbert brings them around. Three and four. Looks at that checkered flag. That's a win for the 01, a chance Gilbert. Second place is gonna go to the 31 on Mike Gilbert. Chris Lutchell picks himself up. Top three finish, Peyton Powell and Phil Berkeybaugh round out the field. And four, hit that raw metal, here we go. Young Holy Mitter on the outside. Scott Drake on the bottom. What a great young talent. Jackie Dalton up at third spot. Patrick Lewis in the trunk coil. Roy Miller. Great, great talent out front. Currently in that second spot, Jack Dalton in third. It's Harris in fourth. Oh, watch out! Drake spins, but is able to avoid everybody. Hoyt Miller in the 56 machine brings him around three and four. Hits that skinny pedal. Here we go. What a blistering pace that 56 is setting here. Running a 19.356, the next closest to that is just about a 20 even. Coming from Jackie Dalton, the 21 machine. Case and Harris, man, up to that second spot. Jackie Dalton gonna run the top side again. Not normally a top side runner. There he goes, looking to the bottom side. Case and Harris holding on. That second spot. Point Miller out front. Point Miller, Case and Harris, Jackie Dalton, your top three. Steve Muhlenberg, Scott Drake able to make it back up to a fifth spot. Gonna be a bit of a job catching up. Jackie Dalton still trying to work that bottom underneath. Case and Harrison, a double zero machine. We're on lap number four here. Gonna look into the top side. He's got a good run coming off of four. He's got a wheel in. Boy, he's gonna make him pay with sheet metal.
Ten to go there. Hoyt Miller still got a big lead out front. Three seconds the last time. Jackie Dalton holding on to that second spot over Casey Harrison at double zero. Scott Drake has made his way up to four. He's got Casey Harris there in his sights. As he reels him in, coming into three and four. He's not high side. Boyd Miller, the future of racing, the future of dirt track racing, looking awesome going down the back stretch into turn number three and four. Jackie Dalton able to get around Case and Harris quite a bit. Dalton 2.950 seconds away from Hoyt Miller. Scott Drake working on Case and Harris right now. It's going to be a good battle for third there. Drake with an excellent run on that top side. Case and Harris on the bottom side. Harris motors down. Kimsey going to be the next machine to go under a lap down. Case and Harris doing an awesome job of fighting off Scott Drake there. White flag coming out for your leader, Hoyt Miller. Drake gonna give her one more chance on the top side. Good, good run for Case and Harris. Drake gonna look to the bottom side. Your winner, Hoyt Miller. Second place, Jackie Dalton. Case and Harris able to hold off. Scott Drake. Steve Muhlenberg rounding out your top five. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for the young Hoyt Miller in the 56 machine. Jackie Dalton coming in that second spot, 2.7 seconds behind, and Kaysen Harris rounding out your top three. Green flag, here we go. Gonna be a good race between them two front cars, Tyler Grooms. Mickey Burrow Groom is going to assume the lead going down the back stretch here. Burrow tucks it in the second. Burrow going to walk. Work. Burrow going to work that high side. Just about got a nose there as he comes around one and two. Burrow must have found exactly what he's been missing these last couple weeks. A couple strings of bad luck. Tyler Grooms out front by one-tenth of a second over Mickey Burrow. Dwayne Hobbs in that second spot, third spot rather. Jared Dotson make the Hager rounding out your top five. Harry bring it up. He's in that fourth spot looking to go around Hobbs for third. Hager on the bottom side, Hobbs on the top side. Good even matches they come around one and two. Hager able to take over that third position. Jared Dawson way high. Gets her adjusted. Tyler Grooms out front by four tenths of a second over to the 73 of Mickey Burrow last year's points champion. Nathan Hager gonna work on reeling that 73. Afraid that 73 got a little bit smaller out that front window that last time. But Halfway through your USRA modified A feature. Bro, 
with a good run through three and four. Good run through one and two. Tyler Groves just holding on to that bottom. Mickey Burrell trying to earn it the hard way as he comes down the front stretcher side by side. Burrell got a good run off the top. Much better. Now Tyler Groom's nose. Burrell, good run off, and he is your new leader. Burrell out front by four tenths of a second over Tyler Grooms, Nathan Hager in that third spot. We got three laps to go. Gonna be two laps this time by. There are two flanges in the air. Gonna be the white flag this time by. Burrow sends it through a one and two. Coming through three and four. Haven't seen this sight this year, but we've seen it a lot last year. Ladies and gentlemen, taking the win. The 73 of Mickey Burrow. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Mickey Burrow. Dakota Magnin in the 23M out front. Will Tater Shell. And James it side by side, getting a little bumping a Megan going on there. Darren Moyers in the 63, looking at the bottom side. Tater Shell is looking a little wobbly. They'll think twice of it. Je Jesse Booth and Robert Dalton looking to make some moves, but they're waiting. Dakota Maggard, James DeWitt, Tater Shell. Your top three. Moyer's going to look underneath them. He's going to try to take that third spot away. Darren Moyers jumps up. I wonder if he's trying to sing a song when he sings, stack it up, stack it up, stack it up. Green flag, here we go. Dakota Maggard out front, James Wood in that second spot, Darren Moyers rounding out your top three. Jesse Booth making it into the top five here. As he jumps to that fourth position. Tatershaw got that big V8 working. He'll go around him on that top side. Boyer looking to the inside of James DeWitt as he come through a three and four. Top three, really bunching up there. Darren Moyers are gonna go for the lead here. Moyers to it, and Maggard halfway through your race here. Moyers to the lead, out front, James DeWitt, trying to follow him on that bottom side. Witt goes under Maggard. He'll take over that second spot. Maggard not going down easy. They're side by side. DeWitt squeezes them off at the wall. Problems on the Maggard machine. He falls back. 
I think this happened to him last time as well. Robert Dalton jumps up into the top five. Kosh coming out of the number five machine of Trenton Terhurst. Sir, do you have a wheel sticking? I don't think it's supposed to be like that. Five machine will probably take it to the back. All right, here we go. Moyers out front. Do it. And Tater Shaw. Jesse Booth and Robert Dalton up into the top five. Dalton looking to the bottom side of Tater Shaw. Tater Shaw gets a little wild off them turns. It's a good defense mechanism. Oh my goodness, we're three wide. Three laps to go, nine laps down, Darren Moyers. Your current leader, James Witt, in that second spot. Will, Will Tater Tall. In third. Green flag, here we go. Good restart for Dalton. He's up to that fourth spot again. Jesse Booth going to take her off into the pits. Daryl Powers all over the backside of the 114 machine. Oh, they spin! He is the little engine that could not. The number 11, I think he was. Takes her to the back. All right, going to try this again here. Darren Boyers, James DeWitt, and Will Tatershaw, your top three. Daryl Powers and Robert Dalton. Lights are out. Green flag. Here we go. Darren Moyers out to a pretty good lead. Tater Shaw looking to get around. James DeWitt here. He's going to give it all that he's got. Hopefully he doesn't leave it in too long. And he does. They bounce. They touch. He's going to ride that inner ring. Side-by-side -side battle for that fourth position. Who's going to take it? The HHR or the Cavalier? The Cavalier is going to take it. Robert Dalton taking home that fourth spot. Meanwhile, out front, Darren Moyers. With the win. 